We're no longer using reading records in school. We've recently moved on to the new Go Read programme. Here's a quick introduction which will give you lots of information about the programme. The first thing you need to do is download the Go Apps Parents app from your app store. Once you've downloaded the app, you need to get started by creating your account. Press the Create Account tab, and on the next screen, you'll need to add some personal information, your first name, last name, and email address. Once you've added in your personal details, you'll need to check your emails. You will have received an email with a five-digit verification code. If you can't see the email, please check your clutter or junk folders as occasionally the email can go into those folders. You'll then need to connect to your child. Your child's class teacher will have sent you a parent invitation which has the information on that you need. To connect to your child, you'll need to add in the school code and login code which is on the letter that your child's class teacher has sent you. Check that the name of your child is correct and select this is my child. The next screen will prompt you to create a reading schedule with your child. This enables you to set aside some time daily where you will read with your child. It could be at breakfast, bedtime or straight after school, whatever time works best for you. If you wish to create a reading schedule, click on the Read Schedule tab. Alternatively, you can press Skip and set up the schedule at a later date. In order to log reading with your child, press Add Log. Here you'll be able to see the reading book that your child's class teacher has set them. Click on the book to log the reading. Click on the square with the pencil in it to log when you read. And press done with the time. You then log the pages read. So James previously read to page 15. So log the number of pages that you read with him during this reading time. You then have the option to add a comment if you wish to. If there are any particular words that your child struggled with, you can add these words by clicking the Add Problem Word tab. Once you've finished, press Add Log. If you wish to check your child's reading history, you can do so by clicking the Reading tab and you will be able to see the reading history for each day of that week. For example, we can see here that your child read with a teacher on Monday and you can read the teacher's comments. If you've got more than one child at the school, you can add your other children by clicking the Add Child tab and using the information that will have been sent out from your child's class teacher. If you would like to add your own book from home, you can do so by pressing Add Log and instead of selecting your child's current school reading book, you can add your own book by pressing the green tab at the bottom. The easiest way to add a book is using the ISBN scanner. When you click on this tab, you'll be able to scan the ISBN on the back of the book. Once scanned, press Find My Book. Check that the name of the book is correct, then press Home Book and Add Book. This will then allow you to add a log of reading for the book from home. You do this in the same way as before with the school reading books. If you have any questions or concerns about using the app, please speak to your child's class teacher as soon as possible.